Have you ever wondered how much religious values shaped the political landscape in the United States? It's a question that opens up a broad spectrum of thoughts. In the complex tapestry of American politics, religious values, especially those rooted in Christianity, have always held significant influence. From the early days of the nation, the Founding Fathers, many of whom were deeply religious, incorporated Christian ideals into the country's foundational principles. This intertwining of faith and governance set the stage for a political tradition that persists to this day. Religious values have not just shaped policy decisions, but have also acted as a rallying point for communities, a compass guiding moral and ethical debates, and a catalyst for political movements. Indeed, the role of Christianity in the U.S. political discourse is far-reaching, deep-rooted, and complex. So let's delve into the fascinating history of Christian democracy in the United States. The concept of Christian democracy is not as new as you might think. It's a narrative woven into the very fabric of the United States, dating back to the nation's founding years. In fact, the roots of Christian democracy are deeply entrenched in the early history of the United States. The Founding Fathers, many of them deeply religious, were guided by their Christian convictions as they crafted the nation's constitution and laws. They believed in the inherent dignity of the individual, a concept rooted in Christian teachings, and this belief shaped the democratic principles that the nation was built upon. They emphasized freedom, equality, and justice, values that echo the teachings of the Bible. In addition, the early American society was predominantly Christian, and this religious landscape played a significant role in shaping the nation's democratic ideals. The Christian belief in every individual's moral responsibility towards the community, for instance, influenced the development of the nation's civil society and its emphasis on civic participation. The early Christian Democrats believed in the principle of subsidiarity, that is, the idea that decisions should be made as close as possible to the level of the individual. This principle, rooted in Christian teachings on the dignity and freedom of the individual, influenced the development of the American federal system, where power is shared between the national and state governments. Furthermore, the Christian doctrine of the common good, the belief that society should be organized in a way that benefits all its members, influenced the establishment of the nation's welfare system. The Christian Democrats advocated for policies that promoted social justice and protected the rights and welfare of the less fortunate. In these ways, Christian values played a significant role in shaping the nation's democratic principles and institutions. From the drafting of the Constitution to the formation of the nation's laws and welfare system, Christian democracy was instrumental in shaping the United States as we know it today. With these foundations, Christian democracy continued to evolve and shape the political landscape of the United States. As the country grew, so did the influence of Christian democracy. From the early days of the Republic, the intertwining of faith and politics has been a defining characteristic of the American political landscape. But as we move through the 19th and 20th centuries, this relationship evolved and deepened. Let's turn back the clock to the mid-19th century. During this period, America was in the throes of the Second Great Awakening, a religious revival that swept the nation. This fervor found its political expression in the emergence of Christian democracy, a movement that sought to infuse governance with Christian principles. Fast forward to the 20th century, a time marked by significant social change. With the advent of the civil rights movement, the anti-war protests, and the sexual revolution, the role of Christian democracy in American politics became even more pronounced. Leaders like Martin Luther King Jr., a Baptist minister, exemplified this by using Christian principles to advocate for equality and social justice. The late 20th century saw the rise of the Moral Majority and the Christian Coalition, conservative groups that sought to mobilize Christian voters around issues like abortion, school prayer, and traditional family values. These groups played a significant role in shaping the political discourse of the era and solidifying the association between Christian values and conservative politics. But it wasn't just the conservatives. Across the aisle, leaders like Jimmy Carter, a devout Southern Baptist, exemplified the influence of Christian democracy in liberal politics. They championed issues like human rights and social equality, reflecting a different interpretation of Christian principles. Through these transformations, Christian democracy has shown its adaptability, its ability to respond to changing social and political contexts. 
it's been a force for conservative values, for progressive change, and everything in between. From the pulpits to the polling booths, from the civil rights movement to the culture wars, it's left an indelible mark on the American political landscape. This evolution has brought us to the present day, where Christian democracy continues to play a significant role. As we'll see in the next scene, this influence is alive and well in modern U.S. politics. Today, Christian democracy remains a potent force in U.S. politics. As we delve into the present day, this influence is most evident in policymaking, party platforms, and electoral campaigns. Let's take a closer look at how Christian democracy shapes these aspects of modern U.S. politics. Firstly, in the realm of policymaking, Christian democratic values often serve as a compass. They guide lawmakers in their decisions, particularly on social and moral issues. These values are reflected in policies related to marriage, education, and healthcare, among others. For instance, debates around abortion rights and religious freedom often echo the principles of Christian democracy. Next, we turn to party platforms. Both the Democratic and Republican parties have been influenced by Christian democratic ideas, though in different ways. For the Republicans, this influence is often seen in their emphasis on traditional values and the sanctity of life. On the other hand, the Democrats' focus on social justice and care for the marginalized also aligns with Christian democratic principles. Now let's look at electoral campaigns. Candidates on both sides of the aisle often appeal to Christian democratic values to garner support from voters. These appeals can be seen in campaign speeches, political advertisements, and even in the candidates' personal narratives. This trend underscores the importance of Christian democracy in the political discourse of the United States. However, this intertwining of religion and politics also sparks debates about the separation of church and state. Some argue that religious values should not influence public policy, while others believe that these values provide a moral framework for political decisions. This ongoing conversation is a testament to the complexity of Christian democracy's role in U.S. politics. Clearly, the influence of Christian democracy is far-reaching in the United States, even in the 21st century. As we continue to navigate the political landscape, it's crucial to understand how these religious values shape our nation's discourse, decisions, and direction. Looking ahead, the role of Christian democracy in U.S. politics is likely to remain significant. As we journey into the future, we can anticipate that the principles of Christian democracy will continue to serve as a powerful compass guiding the nation's political discourse. The future, however, is never without its challenges. As our society becomes increasingly diverse, the challenge will be to uphold the principles of Christian democracy while respecting and incorporating the values of all citizens. This will necessitate a broadening of the political conversation and an openness to new perspectives. Yet, this diversity also presents opportunities. As more voices join the dialogue, the principles of Christian democracy can be applied in new and innovative ways. This can lead to fresh solutions to old problems and a deepening of our democratic process. Moreover, in an age marked by political polarization, the values of Christian democracy, such as dignity, freedom, justice, and solidarity, can serve as a unifying force. They can bridge divides, fostering dialogue and collaboration across party lines. However, for Christian democracy to continue to shape our nation's politics, it must adapt to the changing times. It must be flexible, willing to evolve and grow. It must be dynamic, responsive to the needs and aspirations of the people. And it must be inclusive, embracing the richness of our nation's diversity. We can also anticipate that Christian democracy will continue to influence the policies and legislation of the future. From social issues to economic policies, the principles of Christian democracy can serve as a guiding light, shaping the decisions that will impact the lives of millions. In conclusion, the future of Christian democracy in U.S. politics is likely to be as diverse and dynamic as the nation itself. It will face challenges, but it will also find opportunities. It will evolve, but it will also stay true to its core principles, and it will continue to shape the nation's political discourse, influencing the decisions that will shape our future. Only time will tell how Christian democracy will continue to influence the United States political landscape. In conclusion, Christian democracy has a long and influential history in U.S. politics. From its birth, it has played a pivotal role in shaping the nation's political discourse, intertwining religious values with democratic principles. 
This unique blend of faith and politics has created a dynamic, evolving force that has left its mark on everything from policymaking to public sentiment. Over time, Christian democracy has adapted, reflecting the changing societal values and needs, yet its core principles have remained intact. Today, it continues to exert a significant influence on modern U.S. politics, coloring the way we understand and engage with issues of public concern. And as we look towards the future, the impact of Christian democracy remains evident. It continues to shape our political landscape, informing our understanding of democracy and our approach to governance. As we've seen, the influence of Christian democracy in U.S. politics is both profound and enduring, shaping the nation's past, present, and likely its future.